so funny hey everybody how y'all doing it's uh, uh so let me tell you something i woke up a little bit early today because my daughter woke up um the dog woke up my daughter so i'm feed i'm feeding her i was feeding her watching freaking baby sharks and all these baby music for like two hours doing doing the most so anyways guys so you know so i'm here i'm here to tell you this thing right because you know i'm just so sick and tired of people so let me tell you something so these youtubers yesterday there's these youtubers they are actually a big influence right but you know clearly they don't like me because they always say mean disgusting things about me but my thing is that it's like you know what i hate i hate when youtubers i hate when people they have a big influence like when it comes to me when it comes to me um nobody ever want to do research or nobody ever want to scroll down and do they and nobody nobody ever want to do research nobody even care to know what they they speaking about so yesterday i put a chart how you know my my album invasion of privacy is still selling worldwide it's still top 10 on worldwide sales and then you know people don't do their research like i said let me try uh, to look for what i'm trying to talk about let me try to look for what i'm talking about right so i posted blah, 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 blah. where is it i'm trying to look for it mother Sorry, I just take a lot of pictures and I do a lot of things. So, yeah. So, I posted this, right? Ah, I posted this. And, you know, it says 0% right here. So, 0% means that it, when it comes to change, that it didn't went higher, that your sales didn't increase, or it didn't uh, decrease. It just practically stood the same. So, they were like, oh, it doesn't make no sense how everybody else has changed besides cardi well so weeks before that you know weeks before that i'm trying to look for the new stuff um uh, weeks before that um post malone kendrick lamar and adele they they decreased and mines were were the change were zero percent they were zero percent so why y'all don't question that why y'all always got to question me? Which, and like three weeks before that, my album, it, it actually did made a change. It was a 6% decrease. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, why is it that every single time that I try to, like, when, like, every single time people constantly always try to discredit me? And my thing is, wait, let me just change this up. Let me put this. This is pretty. Oh. Yes, star. Wait, I don't know how to turn this off. Turn it off. Take this off. Let me look. Matter of fact, let me look for a picture. That's a video of a peacock. My mom sent me a video of a peacock. Let me find something else. There we go. Let me just post this. <laughs> so anyways. Okay. So anyways, right? Like, it's like, my thing is, if I'm such a piece of if I'm so whack, everything, I don't understand why if I'm so trash... And everybody got an excuse. Like, first thing first, everybody keeps saying, Cardi, why you keep doing festivals and this, this, and that? You're not making your old shows. Well, why wouldn't I be making festival when they're paying me seven fifty to a million to do so? And then on top of that, then I do my own concert, my own concert, and I sold everything out. And still people are looking for mother excuse. Like, it's like, there's a reason why I'm headlining all of these shows. Because I bring people out there's a reason why i've been taking my time also because i have been offered deals 
uh, tour deals and I don't feel like it's enough. Like before you do before you do a tour, there's there's companies that offer you a tour deal. And you make you you get this tour deal and plus you make money off your your tour sales. I believe that I deserve more than what they offer because I know that I bring a lot of people out. I know that that's like that's like for example, right? That's like for example, if I book a show in February to be for October, between that time my numbers will go high. So before you do a big tour deal, you gotta take your time so people could offer you the price that you want. And guess what? When I close down on that tour deal, I'm gonna make sure that y'all see the announcement. Period. If I'm such a piece of shit, why is it that it is like I'm constantly in people's mouth? I'm constantly in these YouTube blogs, all oh, this evil, all oh, this, this, and that. I haven't really been paying attention to all the to everybody talking crap about me because I feel like I feel like I'm in a better space in life right now. Not just a better space, but it's just like just like everybody else. Besides my career, I, I have responsibilities. You know what I'm saying? Like, besides my career, I have a a a, a big responsibility right now. Um, I'm trying to. I, I'm I'm in the process of purchasing a house, and that comes with a lot of stress, and that comes with a lot of negotiation, and that comes with a lot of emotions because you see a perfect house. But you're negotiating it and, you know, you do inspections in the house and there's certain problems in the house. Then you got to think about you want to buy the house, but you're in a contract. You know, it's a lot of things with, when it comes to that. And then on top of that, like, it's like I have a child, right? I have a child. And when it comes to having a child, especially around the age that my daughter is in right now, um, my daughter knows me and she be on the, she be on my. 24 7 and the issue is i'm always traveling my daughter cannot always travel because her ears pop really terribly so i'm always thinking about hmm my kid and then on top of that like it's like i feel like this is the age right now that i kind of want to put my kid in the school but then again i'm a little opposed to that because it's like I don't know how my kid will react with other people. And my mom, she she just so overly protective with my kid. And then I'm so overly protected with my kid because, you know, we're in a different line right now. And it's just like every single day when you have a kid, you think about your kid. You think about the future of your kid. You think about what, what's going to happen um, when you not if you're not around for your kid. Every single day, those type of things are like, when people think that I'm thinking about something, I'm really thinking about my kid my kid my kid because i think that's just how your brain programs when you have a child you know what i'm saying so it's like i'm not thinking about the streets like that anymore i'm not thinking about what somebody's uh issue with me is anymore because it's like i ha i have i have something right now and that's my kid and so and then on top of that then you have my then I have my music career you know what i'm saying and it's like you got to think about that you got to think about work and then i got other deals on the table that is like I gotta think about how am I gonna balance it with my music career because a lot of these um endorsements a lot of these um these deals and everything they are really great for my for my life for my future they will take me to better places it's like wow it's so great but how am I gonna balance it out with music touring because I'm planning on touring everything so it's just like there's so much things when it comes to work when it comes to my life that it's like i gotta focus on that i gotta gear up and i gotta plan properly like it's all about planning things properly you know what i'm saying i kind of wanted to do a lot of things this year but i couldn't because we planned out so many shows so many shows that it's like oh I'm not able to do this movie because I got to do shows. Oh, crap. I haven't been able to be in the studio because I got all these shows. And it's like we can't balance it out. So it's all about me trying to balance out how am I going to do my music, do all this business uh, adventures at the same time. And at the same time, balancing out how I'm, uh, my motherhood. Like, it's all about motherhood to me. Like, it's all about that right now. I don't give a fuck about nobody else. Whatever chit chat's going on, I don't care. I cannot let that disturb my peace, 
disturbed where I'm trying to go. I'm really trying to go far in life because it's just like, it's not about me anymore. It's not about me anymore. It's all about somebody else. And that somebody else is my kid. I got to be busted for my kid. Um, not, not, not too long ago, not too long ago, well, actually a couple of months ago, I told my business manager that every check that I get, every check that I get, every single check that I get, every single check, no matter what, out of that check, I need a certain percentage of my check to go to my daughter's um account so it's like i'm really busting my ass for my kid future you know what i'm saying like it's like i could let's say if i don't if i'm not here in this world tomorrow i know that i it, it, my, my daughter's set up because i'm busting for my kid you know what i'm saying i'm doing all this thing for my kid oh what's up osuna thing is just so different and it's crazy because i was talking to my friend star earlier and we was just talking about how how we how we growing up how we just so focused on other things like you know like it's like in in like six years from now i'm gonna be i'm gonna be 30 no not six years from now i'm bugging like in four years from now i'm gonna be 30 and i'm trying to i'm trying to like do everything now that i'm that i'm younger that i'm hot that i'm fresh i'm trying to secure everything right now a lot of people from the music industry that have been here for a long time they always tell me that secure it right now and even when i was a the older females used to be like secure your money right now when you hot that's what i'm trying to do and it's that like i cannot let nothing distract me from that nothing distract me from that well i am going to go eat some breakfast I'm going to go eat some breakfast. I'm going to take a nap because Kojer is on her nap time. And um, after we wake up, I'm going to take her bath. And then I'm going to go to the studio. I got so many things to do. And, yeah, uh, I'm going to be doing a lot of uh, announcements of things. And, yeah. Joe, I'm in the hood, too. I'm in my grandparents' house. You know what I'm saying? And oh, look like at Star right there. Like we was just, we was just talking earlier. Like it's like God, we want to do so many things. We we really trying to set up ourselves in the future. Because let me tell you something. Like I feel like I always been black sheep. My friend always been black sheep. We just always been street girls. That I feel like people always see like street girls. And and it's just like as we get older, as as we we see that we're beautiful, we see our potential, we see what we can do. And it's just like we we want. We want better for herself. Like, I, I just want better for myself. Like, sh she wants better for herself. My sister, she wants better for herself. Everybody just wants better for ourself. And that's just the type of time that we on. The type of time that we on. We already been in the streets. We already did the streets. We already did the, the, the gang. We already been about that life. We already party. Like, we party like a like i'm party out i've been i've been in these streets since i was 15 and stuff 16s like i've been doing forever it's like bossing up it's time to boss up it's time to like boss up do things with our money because get money it's always been getting money what are we gonna do with our money what are we going to do about it? How are we going to keep on making money? How are we going to make money to the point that it's like when we don't want to work no more, we're still going to be good? And that's the type of time that money is on. No matter what what career, what, what we're doing in life, it's all one focus. That's the type of focus that people got to be on. That's the type of focus that I'm on. I don't know what type of time anybody's on. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm trying to do. That's, it is what it is. 